Hello, my name is Martin Unferdorm and I'm an application engineer here at Contron in Deckendorf. Today I want to show you our new toolset called KStation and how easy and simple it is to change and enable a boot logo on our modules. Whenever we start a module with default settings, we see the post screen which gives us information about the boot up process. Maybe your marketing department does not want that your device will look like a standard PC and therefore it is very easy to change this by enabling dark boot in the BIOS setup. In the boot menu we enter the boot settings configuration and enable dark boot. Then let's save and reboot. Now I want to show you how you can implement your own boot logo with the help of KStation. KStation is our toolset that consists of shell tools and a graphical user interface that you can also use in your own applications. With BIOS modified, I open the BIOS modification tool and now I select the module type a logo and I'm using the existing BIOS and replacing the BIOS directly. I select now the logo graphic file and now I start the process. Until this process is running, I can tell you a little bit more about our KStation tool. KStation also helps you to give you bot information about the system, read out the serial number and other information. It gives you information about uh, the Ethernet and the smart battery systems that might be connected. It helps you to control the hardware by changing the backlight brightness of your display, for instance, or also it helps you to control the watchdog, the i square c buses, the storage areas and the GPIO ports. It is also possible to monitor the temperature sensors that are on the modules and the fan speeds and the voltages of the system. I'm not only able to modify the BIOS, I'm of course also able to flash the BIOS and uh, by checking for updates, I can immediately uh, open the customer section of our website where you can directly check if new BIOSes are available. Now the BIOS modification process is almost finished and now I can reboot the system and I can now check if a new boot logo is implemented. This takes some time, so let's wait for that. And here the boot logo is visible. As you could see, it was very simple and easy to implement a boot logo in our module with KStation. Thank you very much for your attention and see you again.